Well, church family, we are reopening. The day has finally come. We are so excited, but how is it going to look? Pastor Steve? Well, first thing you'll notice is when you come to church on Sunday, the doors will be wide open. And that's for two reasons. One, to get good air circulation, and two, so you don't have to touch the door handles. Also, if you want to, we can actually check your forehead temperature and see, okay, you look pretty good, Pastor Josh. And if you feel like your uh, temperature might be a little high and you'd rather stay home, that's okay. We want people to feel safe. We want you to stay home and watch online if you need to, but come on out if you're feeling safe and healthy. Coming on in, if you don't bring your mask with you, which it is wise to do so, we do have masks. We also have hand sanitizer. So we're trying to follow everything, every guideline that they've given for your safety. Bring your mask from home if you have one you like, like I'm wearing around my neck right now so I can talk, <laughs> or grab one of ours from right here. And then keep going, because these doors will be open too. You will not be receiving a bulletin. You won't be doing anything normal like that, but. And the next thing you might notice that is unusual is that every other row has a chair on the end turned backwards, and that's to uh, get some social distancing. So nobody will sit in this row, but this row is open. Then we'll skip this row, and this row will be open. And it's the same on both sides. So that gives us an automatic social distancing from front to back. Side to side, we would suggest this. If you're with your family, you all sit together. If you're not with your family, and you come in and sit here, the next person who would come would sit over there. So it would leave some distancing side to side as well. If you look up front, this is what you're gonna see. It's not a typical Sunday. This is more of a studio. This is how we've been doing our live stream services throughout this whole pandemic. We're gonna to continue to do our live stream, but right now you're basically coming into more like a studio because there's gonna be a lot of people still staying home. We understand that. And we encourage you, if you do have any health concerns, do please stay home. And you've probably heard this expression before. This show was filmed in front of a live studio audience. So that's what we've got going on here Sunday. Those who are coming to experience worship and the word live, and those who are experiencing it through the internet broadcast. Now also keep in mind that even though we come in through the front door, at the end of the service, we would like everybody to exit through the side doors so that we're not bumping into people that are coming in for the next service. So in through the front and out through the side, we'll keep everyone safe. Now at this point, the governor has allowed 50 people indoors. So that's what we're planning for this Sunday. But the first service is gonna be an indoor service. If weather permits, we're gonna do an outdoor service because outdoor service, there's no limits. We can have as many people as we want. We'll be back on the other side of the Family Life Center where we had the drive-in service. We're gonna have it all full of seats spread around, practicing social distancing, still wearing masks, but we'll have an indoor and outdoor service if weather permits. If weather isn't good, we will have both services indoors. And you might say, well, what happens when you hit 50 people? Well, we have two buildings and they're separated so they can actually hold 50 each. We already have chairs set up in the Family Life Center, also spaced apart for for social distancing, and we have a large screen over there and a projector. So we will take what's happening here in the church and broadcast it live right over into the Family Life Center. So if you're among the first 50 in the building, you'll be sitting here. If you're among the next 50, you'll be in the Family Life Center getting the exact same service. It's gonna be great worship. My wife's gonna be bringing the word from John chapter four, and we're doing everything that we can possibly do to keep everybody safe and make the experience enjoyable for all of us. So remember, if you have a mask you like, you can bring it. If not, we have them at the church for you. We have hand sanitizers. We have wipes in the bathrooms. We're gonna to work together as a church family to make this an awesome Sunday. And as we move forward and the seating uh, is allowed more and more each week, we're gonna do this together and we're gonna do it right. We do encourage you, you know, of course we want to greet one another, we want to hug, we want to shake hands, but we just got to refrain from that for now. 
but at least what we can do is we can see each other, and that's going to be a blessing. Amen. Amen. And Pastor Josh, you're still healthy. <laughs> <laughs> and by the way, parents, at the present time, we're not going to have children's church, so we're going to continue to post online videos for your kids to watch, and even if you come to church, you can watch it at home. Plus, all the kids who come to church, we're going to make sure they have activities to color and crayons to do that while they're with you. But they will need to sit with you during the service for these coming weeks. All right? Bring your kids out. We love seeing them.